please click our subscribe button and our notification bell to receive notifications on our latest uploads. Thank you. Hi kids! This is Teacher Zaida. And our topic for today is multiplying numbers up to three digit numbers by two digit numbers without or with regrouping. Okay, to start our discussion, let's read this problem. Let's begin. My cousin Farida needs to bake two boxes of cupcakes for her customer. If a box contains 24 cupcakes, how many cupcakes must she bake in all? What must we do to find the total number of cupcakes Baker Farida must bake? Anyone? Yes, very good kids! We must multiply 24 by 2. Good job! Okay, let's multiply 24 by 2. So we have 24 times 2. This 24 is what we call the multiplicand. And this 2 is what we call the multiplier. And the answer that we are looking for is called the product. Now how do we multiply? We multiply the multiplier to the multiplicand starting from the digit from the right. So we multiply 2 and 4. And 2 times 4 we get 8. And then we multiply 2 again to the next digit from the right which is 2. So, 2 times 2, we get 4. So, our answer is 48. Very good. So, meaning, Baker Farida must bake 48 cupcakes in all. Did you get that? Okay, good job. Okay, let's have another example. Let's multiply 132 by 21. So 132 times 21, we multiply first the ones digit of the multiplier to the multiplicand starting from the right. So 1 times 2 is 2. 1 times 3 is 3. And 1 times 1 is 1. And then we multiply the tens digit of the multiplier to the multiplicand again starting from the right. 2 times 2 is 4. Now, why did we write 4 at the tens place value? Because 2, our multiplier, is at the tens place value. Okay, very good. Okay, now 2 times 3 is 6 and 2 times 1 is 2. And then we add this. These are what we call the partial products. And if we add these partial products, we will get what we are looking for, which is the product. So we add 2 to nothing. And we get 2. We add 3 to 4. And we get 7. We add 1 to 6. And we get again 7. Again, we add 2 to nothing, so we have 2. So our final answer is 2,772. Did you get that? Okay, let's try this one. How about 435 times 13? We multiply the ones digit of the multiplier to the multiplicand starting from the right. So we multiply 3 and 5. 3 times 5, we get 15. 
Now remember, if our product is 10 and up, we have to regroup. So we regroup this one to the tens place value. Did you get that? Okay, let's continue. Now we multiply 3 and 3. 3 times 3 we get 9. And then we add this one that we regrouped. So 9 plus 1 we get 10. Again, we regroup 1 to the hundreds place value and then we multiply. 3 times 4, we get 12. And then again, we add what we regrouped. 12 plus 1, we get 13. Questions? Okay. Now we multiply the tens place value to the multiplicand. 1 times 5, we get 5. 1 times 3, we get 3. 1 times 4, we get 4. And then we add the partial products. We bring down 5 because we are adding 5 to nothing. Then 0 plus 5, we get 5. 3 plus 3, we have 6. And 1 plus 4, we get 5. So our answer is 5,655. Questions? Okay, good job. Okay, let's check if you were able to understand our lesson for today. Let's try this. Multiply the following. Are your papers and pencils ready? Okay, let's do number one. Number one, it's 245 times 14. 245 times 14. Okay, are you done? Okay, let's do number two. Number two, it's 126 times 23 126 times 23 if you think this video lesson is too fast for you just simply pause and then try to finish what you are trying to multiply okay okay are you done with number two okay let's do number three number three is 372 times 35 372 times 35. Okay, let's do number 4. Number 4, it's 184 times 71. 184 times 71. Again, if you're not yet done multiplying, just simply pause this video lesson, okay? And last number, number 5, it's 538 times 26. 538 times 26. Please pause the video lesson if you're not yet done multiplying your numbers 1 to 5. Okay, finished? Okay, good job. It's time to check your answers, kids. Are you ready? Okay, shout your answers. Let everyone know you got it right. Ready for number one? What's your answer for number one? Shout it. Okay, number one answer is 3,430. Number two, shout your answer. Okay, good job. Number two is... 2,898. 
How about number three? I can't hear you again. Okay, number three, it's 13,020. How about number four? What's your answer? Again? Okay, good job. It's 13,064. How about number five? Again, your answers? Okay, number five is 13,988. Very good, kids. Did you get a perfect score? Okay, good job. Okay, that was an awesome work today, kids. Until next time, goodbye.